Hi guys, today, I really don't know what this video is going to be about today. Um, I guess I just wanted to talk to you guys about some stuff. Um, this week on Twitter, um, I guess you would have heard or found out that one of our fellow beauty bloggers um, passed away. Uh, her name was Safi Lalem. Um, her blog was known as Safi Style. And she passed away this week um, due to breast cancer. And I just wanted to kind of touch on that for a moment. Uh, around four or five years ago, um, my brother passed away and he was 18. And he came down with some rare illness and he went, you know, he went to the hospital just for regular cold type symptoms. And you know, they did all these tests and they found out he had this rare disease that hits only a few people out of a million every year. So he kind of struggled with it. Um, he went into a coma for, I believe, around 30 days. And he came out of the coma and he was just catatonic. And he kind of stood like that for a year. And, you know, as a family, we decided that because he was so young, he was just better to just you know there was no hope there was no hope um, it was just bad all the way around you know the doctor said because he's so young he can live a full life but stuck in that bed um, you know he wouldn't be able to talk or to communicate he couldn't even he couldn't do nothing he was just basically a vegetable in a bed so you know after a year or so of suffering with it he passed on then the following year um, my the brother that was older than him, but he's younger than me also, he passed away the following year. Um, he just had a heart attack at 36 and he was gone. Um, so getting back to Safi, um, she and I were having this conversation on Twitter, just a normal, you know, what's going on with you type thing. And um, this guy kind of butted into our conversation mentioning that um, something about eating boiled eggs helps reduce your risk of breast cancer and Safi at that point just went off and she ripped this guy a new one she told him how she's had breast cancer and she's eaten boiled eggs all her life and how um, you know, it didn't help anything. And, you know, then I got involved and I told him, you know, the story about my brothers and the way I see it is that no matter what you do, you know, when God wants you, he's going to take you no matter what you do or what goes on. I know that my brother was breastfed. I know that he was a very healthy boy. He was never sick a day in his life. And, you know, he was just always full of energy and just very active. And, you know, this illness hit him and it took him away. With my other brother, you know, he had kids and a wife and a home and, you know, they were living their life. And at dinner, you know, after dinner, he just he went to sleep and he never woke up. So, you know, that's the mindset that I was on. And so Safi got upset and kind of ripped this guy a new one. And then I got involved and I'm like, who are you to tell anybody? You know, and he kept persisting that boiled eggs cure cancer or something like that. And, you know, it just got to us, you know, her for herself and me for my brothers. It's like, you know, I'm, I'm tired of people telling me about all these preventions and everything when you know what? There was no reason for my brother to die. There was no reason for Safi to die. There was no reason for my other brother to die, but it happened. And so me and Safi started talking um, and she created this crazy hashtag called boiled eggs or not. And um, you know, I told him, I told him I drink, I smoke. And you know what, with what I've seen in life and my father coming down now with cancer and everything, you know what, I'm gonna live my life. I'm going to live it. I know some of you out there are saying no and that's bad for you and that's all good and fine. But to me, I'm going to live my life and that's it, you know. I'm gonna make myself as happy as I can because you never know. Tomorrow, it may be your last day. 
it may be the last day of someone that you love so every day love yourself every day love the people and tell them that you love the people that are important to you don't let it go by because you never know if that person's not going to be there tomorrow live your life do what makes you happy if you are not hurting anybody and you're not breaking any type of law you know where you, you don't want to go to jail do what makes you happy don't care what others think it's your life do what you want to do live and enjoy every moment that you have um, and don't let nobody hinder you don't let nobody stomp or rain on your parade do what makes you happy no matter what the cost because life is short and you're gonna look back and you may have missed your opportunity you may have missed that chance to do what you want so do whatever you need to do to make you happy and don't worry about everybody else do what is best for you so pertaining to boiled eggs or not um, I'm going to continue the hashtag this was supposed to be a collab between me and Safi and you know boiled eggs or not live your life do your thing and do what makes you happy you know yeah she was very big on breast cancer awareness so I'm going to get involved in that on my blog and kind of put the word out there were certain charities that I do have to go back through her Twitter and kind of find out what charities for breast cancer and breast cancer awareness that she was involved in and I just want you guys to just get this message out get the message out boiled eggs or not live your life do what makes you happy don't put nothing on hold don't don't delay on your happiness your happiness is way too important don't give that up for nobody so um yeah that's it I know this was kind of like a bummer video but um, it, it's a real important message and it needs to be known so Safi this one's for you babe boiled eggs or not bye